my canoe, which is about water and energy, specifically about the hidden side of water and how we don't realize that um, water is involved in the manufacturing process, um, it's involved in all our modern day conveniences. And so for my canoe, I wanted to incorporate one, of course, the water element, um, which are these powerful swirly waves right here, and just, the, just to emphasize the power of water in itself, but then also I have these concentric circles and it is actually a water ripple. So you can see there's a water drop in the middle, drops in the middle, creates a ripple, so it's a ripple effect. Um, and then of course I have the light bulbs, the idea of water and uh, energy and electricity. And then the icon for the cell phone battery right here uh, to remind us that without water we would not have our modern day conveniences like cell phones. So that was the idea and concept behind my canoe and the process. Right, this is my canoe. I wanted to start off with um, different types of drinks that we consume every day. Um, and I wanted to, to flow down like a river. This right here shows how we are all one with water and how we use it, and how we use our watershed. So this is our wetland right here. And um, I like gray days, and I like how colors pop off our gray days near water. Since it was flowing down, I wanted to do a bubbling brook. And if you look close in there, if you look through all the rocks, you can find a small little baby turtle. Now the same place where we have fun in the water, I wanted to incorporate it flowing down through our, uh, into our watershed and into people's farms where we get our water through wells and, and how we distill it to create alcohol. I wanted to show White River flowing down into Indianapolis, the cityscape of Indianapolis. In my opinion, the White River is a asset to our community and to us as individuals. Um, it's a it's a vein that runs through our city, a common thread, it brings us together. Recreation, entertainment, habitat for animals and plants, even in our cities. And it's also a resource for our consumption. I feel like it's something that we take for granted and we don't, sometimes we just forget that it's there because everything is around us and given to us when we need it. Really connected to the White River. Um, I grew up in the desert. I grew up in uh, California and Las Vegas and so every summer we would come to Indianapolis to visit family and I was really uh, enamored by the waterways in Indiana, the rivers and the creeks and uh, the lakes and whatnot. So I made the decision when I was 18 to move to Indiana and I continue to this day to kayak down White River and canoe down White River. Um, and also for me, like knowing that my family has lived in Indianapolis for generations, it makes me feel connected not only to nature, but like my ancestors as well. Find a canoe near you. Meet the artist. Learn more about the Collective Tap podcast on our website.